Dear Fetus, these words are postmarked in the summer of 2015, but I want to take some time tonight to share with us some sage wisdom that took 19 years to acquire, inspired by uh, blank number of bays, stolen jays, and how apparently not to hold an iron. But before we get it started any more, before we go any farther, I want to take the time to talk about this skin. You see, we have been granted a coating that is the backdrop of the heavens, so some will make you wish that you shone brighter, but. If that gets you down, you can stand tall in the back of those whitewashed critiques. Yeah, they're spending hours under a lamp trying to replicate your God-given attire. And even as your skin resplendent like the sun that was born to reflect repels the scars of such blind resentment, they will not let you rest just yet. Because, ironically, they're even more scared of what's inside of you. You see, they're scared that we've been granted a mind that has the aptitude and magnitude to accomplish feats their lessons tried to whip out of you. So don't you dare settle for mediocrity for the sake of a simple nut or two. Their media will try and tell you that you can't make love. Because you're too busy making love to stay in love. Well, let them know that you are so much more than their little faith in us. Let him know that you will be that father, a man that is the backbone to his red bone and the right hand of his chocolate canvas. You see, the plan is to create a dynasty. Samuel S. Bagley III, and we feel a nasty so that these past me is going to like heresy through this last me. So don't ask me when I'm leaving because I'm not. We're not. When that ring hits your finger, we tied a knot that not a single mask guy could untangle. We created a bond with an angel who could call her gold finger. And even if diamonds were forever, this world is simply not enough because I would rather die another day than break my queen's trust. But let me let you in on a little secret. Finding that woman is going to take a whole lot more than just a little luck because when the time comes, you're going to miss a whole lot of her signals. But in the end, you're going to realize you're playing two different games. You see, while she's playing Rook, you're going to be stuck playing Uno. Every time you try and draw the two of you together, she might just give you the bird and skip right on past you for good measure. Fun fact, there will always be wild cards in play. To compete, you're gonna have to be more original than John Hancock, more suave than Johnny Bravo, give her more than John Legend and never disappear like a John Doe. Like a book you can't even put down, you're gonna have to learn to read it from cover to cover to covers. <laughs> but don't you dare skip over the proposal. You're gonna be taking a knee, but that moment's going to be timeless. Stealing her heart in her hand, performing a heist like none other, because truly, how can you steal something that has a price incalculable, a merit unmeasurable, and a worth that made the son of man give his life so that you could love her? He gave you life so that you could love her. <laughs> he created love so that you could have the chance to love her. So when you make this, this so when you get up the courage to get down on one knee, make sure that that decision is forever because there are no backups, no prenups, just your trust and her heart because this is truly the definition of till death do us part. Mm. Now I know that forever is a rather infinite concept for a finite mind such as ours, but I believe that if you gave it a little bit of time to grow, like the rest of you, you might warm up to the concept. <laughs> and I know that you don't even have the capacity to understand my words just yet, but I pray that when you do, you take the time to take them in and take them to heart because you have quite the journey ahead of you, but I've heard it's worth the start. Yeah. Regards, Samuel Sampson Bagley II. Hey. P.S. Enjoy the ride, because that's as close as you're going to get to one of those for quite some time. <laughs>